All right, so this adventure I'm about to take you guys on with me, I'm connecting this weatherproof outlet along this wall here. I'm gonna tap a hole right next to the door there, pop it inside and hook it up real fast so I can connect my daughter's Halloween stuff. So. but I do not want to drill through this board or that board. This board is holding up this. It's kind of staggering this. And it's taking the weight. So I am going to pass on that. But one of the things I can do, I get a little bit more cement. Because the next problem is the front of the house. It's all asbestos tiles. Right here, this is already breaking up. So what I can always do is pop this out and fill this up with dumb gum or new cement. <laughs> it's just not coming out super easy. All right, so I'm going to get something to knock that out. All right, let's see. I wish I can cut down the sound just a little. Let me make sure the bottom hole is going to hold, line up. It's going to be a one shot deal. <laughs> okay. That black dot still lines up. Good. It's gonna be one, two, three. Down with the noise. <laughs> Done with the noise. Thank God. No more making noise. I should have wore ear protection. I keep trying to stick my field piece probe in there. Okay, that's in there now. Plug in the back. I probably never sees it. Because these never come out in the future. So it doesn't leak. That's what I'm thinking of the never sees. This flashlight needs new batteries. So the never sees will actually act like a lubricant. Good. Next plug. Problem right now. 
now have is that I'm set up for seal tight. So now let's run the wire through. Oh, the batteries at the top are dying. You can see the light flickering a little. Let me put this on. So, you zip tie it. Or you zip tie it and can't move it anymore. Keep them loose for now. So I play and wiggle them. So when it hits the wall, is that or can I bring it from behind? Yeah. Okay. We'll be able to come up and over. Continue down here. Closer, closer, and closer. Oh, 
Okay, here we go. Okay. That's in. So let's see, I put the plugs on the box. I think I'm gonna have to cut it down, but probably put my mollies too high. the molly just a little lower but I can very quickly cut this down right about here should be perfect use a PVC cutter it would have cut the same put it down for a second so since I want to go here give me some slack I don't have to pull as much through let's just see where we land up if I need the trim This might be so hard to cut that little bit. I think putting a 90 fitting on the top is a complete overkill on this. I was considering it, but there's no reason to. There's no way rainwater from all the way. There is going to be coming into this box. Famous last words. <laughs> but what I'm also going to do is I'm going to buy one of the Romex the cable seal type fittings for the top. This is just the time being. I have it pretty much stuffed up there. I don't think water's getting in. Famous last words. Somebody about to burn their house down. Electrical fires. <laughs> Fill it bit right here. I gotta clean my workstation, it's getting a little messy. Just a little bit. Or 
first one. solid. During the day I could tighten it up more when it's not so loud. Right now it's a little bit loud so that light's about to die but it's not needed. Let me put it back into my little Vito which for my house shop bag is coming to be very handy. Okay, let me ditch that for one that's got a good battery. Connect this. What I'm going to need to do is move the pin because instead of it swinging this way, I need it to swing up and down. It's going to be mounted this way. So I'm going to pull that pin out, take that out. It should just pop. Famous last words should just. Well, I was wondering why I couldn't find these in my toolbox today. And if this doesn't unclip, it'll break. So. There's our outlet with the directions on the but it says do not let the HVAC hacker install this. Do not let him touch. This is going to go behind the band just like that. Okay, so right now I feel like this is a little too long for my liking. I usually want enough room for it to come out. And then tuck it behind it. There we go. Now we got a lot more light. Those screws. 
Where my screws go? I don't want to lose that little black thing. Where did all my screws go? Okay, so these are tight too. Yep. All right, the ground. Made in China. I guess that outlet doesn't seem like it's the highest quality. Not to knock the Chinese people or anything, but a lot of stuff that came with this thing just kind of seems low quality. Then again, you, you get what you pay for. The Chinese make good product and bad products. You want to pay a dollar per unit, you get a unit that's only worth a dollar. You want to pay four dollars a unit you get a unit that's worth four dollars which means you could sell it here for thirty dollars <laughs> oh, these wires they love to fall out i almost really putting a connector on it to slide it on there i was giving such a hard time hard time hard times why wants to give me hard times? I mean, they make it a hex, but you can't get any thing on there. All right, there's that. I won't go down and then up. Let's open this and close it. I think it just felt tight and it was never tight. Good. Good. I really want to make sure stuff is tight. Alright, so is that a little black? Shoddy thing, shoddy shod shod. Gotta learn how to not play all the time and take life seriously. You think everything's a freaking joke? What's wrong with you? The generation today just has no clue how serious everything is. I dropped the screw. I must go home. I can't pay attention to detail. I suck. You suck. You can't get the screw on. <laughs> so hard why can't you do it what's well, taking so long you must be stuck you must not know what you're doing you must be stuck you should call for help you are stuck you're stuck you're stuck if you're on a job for three minutes you're stuck you gotta call you gotta have reinforcements come because you're stuck you don't know what you're doing you're stuck not for anything where's that other screw look at that beetle cockroach looking thingy oh you're on the outside it's like i am wherever my screw went i'm on the outside <laughs> hmm if i was the missing screw screw again oh did my wire break? No, my wire's still good. Go in my bucket. Now, 
Am I stepping on it? Some nails and screws I dropped earlier today that I was going to clean up. But I got to find this now. Or I go no further. I have other screws, but I kind of want the one that I lost. Just makes sense, doesn't it? That all your screws accounted for. You don't know what you're doing. You don't know what you're doing. Can't pay attention to detail. Can't pay attention to detail. Can't pay attention to detail. Because you can't find the screw. You can't find the screw. You can't pay attention to detail. You can't pay attention to detail. You can't find the screw. Alright, so both the screws are found. Get this in. If I can go smoke a cigar. Oh, I really did that. I did it upside down. Don't know how that friggin' happens. So let's twist it. Yo. I can't believe I want to put it in upside down. Can't wait for my Monte Crisco tonight. Vintage 2 Monte Crisco. Oh, I'm wrong. It's a Romeo and Juliet. Not here. I can't tighten all the way. Yet. I feel like I should. But. It's part of the seal. Probably shouldn't even put the pin in yet. I should have left it loose. too tight. I can't catch it with that, can I? Nope, not yet. Bring it out more. In. In. that and then I got two little screws one two these two let's go right in here not sure what they're really needed for This is already closing it. And top. Ah, oh, 
friggin' ADHD won't let me friggin' wake up on time. Oh, suck. I'm fired. I suck. I wonder what the purpose of this piece is. Kind of connector in, boom. There I go. My GFCI outlet outside. So the hook up. My daughter's. Decorations. Okay. Now I have to find out how to kill power that switch so I could then make this live. Alright, so we're going to be attaching this out of the way. I've already verified the voltage is off while the cover is missing. there I should route to the bottom I want to get all fancy but that might be the best solution I'm gonna need a friggin hammer this to the neutral and they want to bring the load all the way over that's where it's attached this okay we're up <laughs> too lazy to run back outside and get them this thing's gonna break down. Boom. Okay, it broke. Put that on top. But if you're gonna cross thread something, cross thread a lock nut and nothing else. By design, it's very easy to cross thread. It's not like a gas pipe or a bolt, it's got like a flat side to it. So you can hammer to tighten these lock nuts in. Okay, so if I'm gonna be right here, coming through, that's where I'm gonna want to stop stripping it back. I'm gonna start just cut in the middle. I'm going to cut the wire. I'm trying to be a hero. I have my linesman's in my tool bag. Okay, that's good enough. I don't have to go all the way. Um, definitely won't need that. Let's clean 
the whole friggin' basement anyway. Every time I start, all different projects come up. I never get time. I dream of having like a week to just clean my basement. Do nothing else. Clean and organize. And I've been working. I've been buying Milwaukee cases and rigid cases and packing them up full of stuff. One thing I should have done. Oh, I could probably tap in here. Okay. Which means I definitely don't want it to be as long as it is. Right about there. Now. The black wire. Feeding the power. And the red is going. To load. For this to work. Some can push in, others you gotta loosen first. Oh, I like it. It's in. Fortunately, the ground won't be as gentle. But that's okay, I could just twist it or send the screw into the frame. Then I'm gonna have to connect these neutrals. Get the neutral connected. These things are great for a wire like this. You need to wire that out. Orange one. Don't worry, people who think I'm taking too long for the switch. I fired myself 20 times already in this video. I'm gonna do it one more time. You're fired! Go home, don't get no pay. Do you hear what the bad, bad boss man's trying to say? You're fired. My desire, fire. Ooh, what is worth? Fuel is pumping engines. <laughs> That's connecting the ground in a weird way. <laughs> or if I'm not grounded, my ground fault won't work. My GFCI. Probably gonna come back in and fix the ground up. But it's frigging grounded. first before I hate spraying liquid wrench is one it's a little friggin nasty
collar back on. Don't try this at home. I don't feel like. There we go. Grab it and twist it now. Okay, everything's hot. Boom. These are all neutrals. Once that touches, I've created a circuit. Okay. Everything's hot. Everything's hot. Way in the floor, right there. Something's not right. I'll find that out tomorrow. There we go. That's better. Okay. Let's, we're energized. So let's go outside and see if this works. Yep. We're on. set. It's ready to go. That's pretty nice how I painted it. I like it. I should hit the screws up also. Okay, so I see not too much pressure, so I don't damage the paint. Good. All right. Basement bolts. Came on, off, on. All right. So I'm back up and going. I just got to clean up. But there you go. Thanks for joining me for my adventure on connecting this. I got to cut all these zip ties down and everything. But till next time. Peace.